So the other day I went to go register a post office box for Beard of Power Studios, and I realized that it's really hard to get a post office box if you're a homeless man. And that struck me as a case of pretty significant economic discrimination. And it's not the only one. When I was in charge of hiring and firing people at a particular restaurant, which I won't name, I could never hire someone who did not have a physical home address that was not a post office box. And that is some bullshit. When I was younger, I used to do a lot of activism with homeless people. And I realized that, you know what? Not every homeless person is a drug addict or lazy. The fact of the matter is that most of them just ran into some trouble in their life at some point, And they happen to be on the street. And most of them want to get off the street as fast as possible. The problem is that most of our legislation doesn't allow them to get off the street if they want to, because you can't have a job if you don't have a street address and you can't get a f***ing house if you don't have a job. The same is clearly true for post office boxes, but you can't use a post office box to get a job either because that's not a real address. You also can't use a motel room as a physical address because that's not a real address. It's f***ing bullshit. The reality in America is that almost every single American is living one paycheck away from being homeless. If you miss one of your paychecks, all of your debt and all of your housing and all of the things you need to pay are going to collapse on top of you and you are going to be homeless. That is a very real reality that almost all of us have to deal with every single day. And the fact is that homeless people are just people. They're not worse or better or anything else than anybody else. They're just people. And they're people deserving of dignity and respect and love and we are screwing them over with our legislation. There are lots of organizations out there helping to alleviate this problem, one of which is the Catholic Worker House, at least in my town right now. They have an actual house, and they will allow anyone that needs it to use their address as their home address, so they just get all kinds of mail, and that way people can go get jobs. So there's my challenge. Go out and work with an organization that, that is either feeding homeless people or helping them to get jobs or just working for social justice in general. The Harry Potter Alliance is a pretty damn good one, but I don't think they uh, are specifically working on the homeless issue, but they're pretty awesome. So they're working for lots of social justice issues and homelessness should be one of them. Andrew Slack, get on it. Thanks for watching my video. I don't think I have any other videos that talk about this specific issue. So I'll just link some random justice -y issue videos up above me and uh, I will see you guys whenever it is I can make videos again. Hopefully lots more, lots more times. More videos more often. That's the goal. Also, as I briefly mentioned, there's a PO box that's in the description and uh, I always like cookies. Just throwing it out there, cookies are awesome.